Well, welcome to my video. This is a video of my pretty rare basketball game from 1952 called Set Shot Basketball. Um, as you can see, it's sort of a big game. It's got legs and, and that. Um, the object of this game is to pop the ball into the opponent or into your own basket. So as you can see, there's a spinner there that's spinning and there's ping pong balls on the uh, floor of the arcade machine and you have baskets on each side and a scoreboard that keeps track and as you can see on here there's knobs the uh, as you can see the number six is missing but the object of the game is is when the ball goes in let's say number three I want to take the rod and slam it down and it pops the ball up through the air and you try to make it into your basket as you can see on my side I have numbers one through six again I'm missing this six but I have rods so depending on it so the object of the game is like I said is to try and pop your ball in so we're going to try and uh, demonstrate this here see, as you can see and then the other person on the other side We'll try and shoot the ball. So I'm going to try and make a basket. Just missed it. So I'm going to shoot three here. Let's see if I can get over here. Okay, and we'll shoot three over here. And let's see if we can make one here. Not yet. Try it again here. There we go. And I just scored a basket, so it registered two. over here and try a long shot with number five. It's hard, it's hard to videotape this and play at the same time. Let's see if we can make this long shot. There we go. And we score it again. We'll try and make four over here. So anyways, as you can see, when you have two players going at this, if me and another gentleman or somebody that I was playing with, I'd be on this side over here, he would be over here and he'd be shooting this way and I'd be shooting this way and it has automatic score in here and it just keeps track of your score and the first one up to 20 wins. Now let me show you what happens when you get up to 20 here as you score baskets. I'm pushing the actual lever here. Okay, and what happens is the game shuts down, the spinner stops spinning, and the lights dim. It's a very fun game, very competitive game, because you have uh, six holes and six balls, and balls are flying all over the place. And then if you want to play again, you just come up here again, and you push the button, and the game lights back up, and the spinner starts spinning, and you start playing again. This game was actually bought in Pennsylvania and it was actually in Hershey Park Arcade back in the 50s. It was actually in their arcade in the park. And one of the things I liked about this game was not only because of the, the cool cabinet, it's a pretty large game, but what I liked about it was the uh, basketball graphics on like the walls with the cheerleaders and uh, stuff, stuff like that. And the automatic scoreboard. Just really cool looking stuff to look at while you're playing. As you can see that spinner is just spinning. And it's waiting for people to pop the ball into the basket. Just really cool graphics and stuff. I really like this game a lot. It's very fun at a party with two players. Um, you can have a really good time playing it. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, this is game was made in New York City um, by Telematic Industries, so, sold by Mike Munvies, and it was sold to arcades all over the country. Here's a little close-up of the scoreboard there, you can see. And it was 10 cents a play, but I don't have the original uh, original coin slide for it. And there used to be up here, used to be a basketball player, like on top of the marquee. But I hope you enjoyed this video of a rare basketball arcade game from 1952 called Set Shot Basketball.